but the big one better be bigger than the other two. Can you see that point visually? So it's going to be more than a third. It's the biggest, it's the biggest third. And maybe it's going to be not 11%, maybe 15%, or something like that. Just picking it up. So a little more educated guess would be about 15%. Who knows? Maybe the right one. Okay. How do you get the exact answer? You convert this to a Z diagram, just seeing this one more time. And you start out by putting the basic parameters of the Z, which you know about. You can nice well show you, physically show yourself you're going through 5.5 to a corresponding Z score in roughly the same part of it, one third across. To get the exact amount, you don't have to guess it, just plug it right in mechanically into the formula. 5.5 minus 5 over 1.5 comes out to. 0.5 over 1.5 is equal to positive 0.333. But the Z table, you always take it out to two places because that's how the Z table is read. So we want everything between 0 and 0.33. And again, if you take an educated guess, it should come out to about 15% that piece over there. I just going to have to bother Tiffany again since she's the only person with the diagram, I think. If you go to, if you go to the Z table, 0.3, and then you go 3, 0, 3, 1, 3, 2, and 3, 3. What do you see there? 0.6293. So, so again, the, the number she sees there is 6293, which of course is very far from my initial guess at 15%. It's very, what's, what's, the, what's the other manipulation we have to do before we're finished? Yes. Because this gives us the answer, the 6293 is the answer of everything below 33, including this piece here. But we don't want this piece. We want everything, we just want this piece over here. So what do you got to do in order to finish up the problem? You have to realize this piece here is a nuisance that we don't care about. You got to subtract it out because we're simply dealing with the areas. And of course, the final answer is 1293, which is 13%, which is exactly in the middle between David's guess of 11% and my guess of 15%. The truth is somewhere like always in the middle. So the final answer is 1293, or about 13% if you want to that. So if you follow that, you know all of chapter six. If you know all of chapter six, trust me, chapter seven, eight, nine, and ten will be much easier, pretty easy. So please practice this between now and Wednesday. Wednesday is what? Wednesday is what are we doing Wednesday? Wednesday reviewing. Wednesday we're going to review, and then right after Wednesday we're going to release the test and let you take it online three times, take the highest of the three grades, and that's good. All right, folks. If you want to see me at the class.